cold, cold world. Yeah. Yo, what's poppin' YouTube? It's your boy, the main cloud, checking in with another review. Before we get into that, of course, I'll let you know what I'm watching. Some uh, top 100 play players of 215. NFL players of 215 watching on uh, some NFL Network. Just finished uh, eating some breakfast, so I don't have nothing I'm drinking because I just had some iced coffee and I'm not drinking no more. So, anyway, let's get into what we're reviewing today. Right here. Some Famari Tangelo. That's what I call it. I think some people call it some other name, but I call it Tangelo. Whatever. Uh, tell you what I'm got, what I'm smoking out of my R hookah, Alien Funnel Bowl, three Leonardo's, and my Cloud Lotus, of course, and my tonic holes I got from local smoke shop. A lot of people ask me what this is, but it's a tonic holes washable, of course. So let's get into it. Let's get into the clouds. As you can see with Famari, 10 out of 10 puffy white clouds, as you can expect with Famari. Uh, let's get into the taste, or the flavor shift, I should say. Flavor strength, I would say, is about Eight or a nine, uh, you definitely get the flavor straight off the bat with it, and it's a good flavor, man. So let's get what it tastes like now. You guys hear in the background? That's my son playing some basketball. He got a basketball hoop in his room, so like the arcade joints, the basketball hoop, and then the ball rolls down. He got that in his room, so that's what you hear in the background. Alright, so, what you get with this flavor is definitely a citrusy flavor. Um, when I first packed this, I overpacked, I don't know if I was rushing or something like that, and I did not like it at all. So I was like contemplating even smoking again, but of course I did, and underpacked it. And like I said, I must have been rushing, because normally I, I underpack Kamari because it's very wet, juicy flavors that they, they give you, so I normally underpack with them. But, you know, for me, it's, it's definitely a different taste that I'm used to. It's not sweet enough. I mean, you get a little little hint of sweet, but it's more of like an orangey, excuse me, grapefruit flavor, and it is definitely a recommended flavor. I definitely, definitely think you guys should pick it up, try it out. Uh, after the initial smoke you get, you do get a tart flavor at the end in your mouth, but nothing, you, it's definitely bearable, no, no problem. Uh, but if you guys are into citrus flavors, I think a tangelo is like a, a orange and a grapefruit, grapefruit mixed together. And I'll definitely try to pick up the, the fruit itself to see if it compares to the smoke, but the smoke is definitely... Excellent. Definitely uh, recommend you guys pick this up, man. Like I said, guys, I don't know if you overpack all your shisha, but I normally overpack pure and haze. And like I said, I must have been thinking it was some haze or some shit. And I was just packing, and like I said, the first time I tasted it, I didn't like it. But after that initial first... First bowl I had, man, amazing, amazing flavor. Definitely recommend it. Uh, pick this up from Five Star Hookah, like I always do. As you guys can see in my unboxings, where I always pick my shisha up from. But quick review, I've, I've had this flavor for quite a long time. I've been supposed to get a review out for you guys, so I figured today is the best time to do it. 
because I'm going back to work tonight. So I might, it might be tough to get a review out this week. So it's your boy, The Main Cloud, checking out with another review. Of course, my son over there making noise again. Anyway, of course, I got to take you over to the cloud. Let's go. Baby, pat me, though. These niggas, bro. Baby, pat me, though. I make love. Baby, pat me, though.